What's good y'all man, it is your boy Sniper Kicks and I told you guys not to sleep on the Jordan 9 Chili Reds. I didn't take any W's on the sneakers at Men's or GS, but this shoe right here was decent man. The resale price is around that 290 mark. Uh, but guys man, like I said, people actually want this shoe. People like the red with the black and Jordan 9s. Jordan brand doesn't come out with a lot of Jordan 9s, so it seems like people want it. I know the hood wants these Jordan 9s, but going out today in Chicago, about to pick up a good amount of pairs, man. There's a method behind the Flex app, man, and I literally mastered the Flex app, so I'm about to pick up some pairs there. Uh, finish line, JD Sports, they have a lot of late shipments. I think my finish line has GS, and the JD Sports has a few men's pairs and a few GS pairs. I know they're coming in late. So there is going to be late shipments, like I said. So if you did not take a W on this shoe, you still have a chance to take a W down the line. But if you did get this shoe and you're trying to sell it, sell it now, sell it now. Luckily I did pre-orders on this shoe. So I sold them for like 320 a pop, 330. It's crazy because there's a stock X method for pre-orders that I made a lot of money with, man. If you look at the prices on StockX, like those pre-order prices that sold on Monday and Tuesday, yeah, 390, 380, 360. And I was able to sell a few pairs at that price. So, you know, it's good, man. There's a method behind everything. Reselling, there's always a method behind stuff. You can make a lot of money, but you have to know what to do. But guys, about to head out to the first spot, pick up these shoes and keep it moving, guys. Let me know how'd you guys do on the Jordan 9s. If you take W's or L's, I saw a lot of people on my live yesterday take W. So guys, man, make sure you subscribe to the channel, smash that like button, and of course, smash that notification bell because I will keep you guys updated with everything sneakers related. Let's go. So y'all, man, we're at the spot. We're at the Riverside Mall, picking up some of these nines, man. Uh, took an L on sneakers app, but hopefully I can get some pairs here. Uh, the finish line in JD are doing first come first serve. So trying to grab, you know, whatever I can. Cause I do have a lot of orders on these. So let's keep this thing moving. Let's go. So go on the finish line, see what they got in GS. Let's see. These right here, not too bad. And then full locker. These are still sitting, man. This is crazy. I'm going here. So right here, decent pair. Keep moving. So guys, got what I needed right here. Uh, so uh, JD Sports did first come first serve, but I came too late, so I wasn't able to get a pair, but I totally forgot to um, confirm my waitlist pairs, man. And I had some pairs on waitlist and I didn't confirm them, so it is what it is, but you gotta keep it moving, but we got a lot more places we gotta go. Pick up these nines and let's keep it moving. Let's go. Next spot, Foot Locker. So right here, Jordan 9. No problem, brother. Same thing, man. Brotherhoods still sitting. We got these two people, you know, sitters right here. So we're at the next spot right now, heading into this foot locker. And you know, grabbing these nines, man. Grab Not bad. Those were orange. So y'all, man, it is a nice day. Uh, been cooking these nines, man. Been cooking these nines. And basically there's a method to the madness. There's a science behind how I'm getting all these for retail. Uh, so, you know, heading to the next spot, grabbing uh, this shoe, grabbing some more nines. And it's good, man. This shoe right here is like, I was able to, you know, get these shoes off for like 300 a pop, 320 a pop on pre-orders. So I'm making, I'm making a good amount of money on this release over close to around 2000 you know around there on this release just you know getting so many pairs on pre-orders uh, but we'll talk about that when we get back to the crib but you know like i said bricks build houses but you just got to know what you're doing you know you know there's a there's a method that i'm going to talk about on how i'm able to get these pre-orders done uh but you know about to head right now get this shoe and keep it moving let's get it guys another one secured real quick 
Uh, but man, there's a method, like I said, to the madness. Gotta go to a few more spots uh, to pick up some more shoes. But these nines, man, these were money makers. These were money makers. Uh, yes, I sold them, like I said, for around that 300, 320 on pre-orders. So try to get as much as I can, as many as I can. So, you know, let's get it. So y'all at the next spot, still have a few more places to go. But like I said, it is nice outside. People are out and I'm picking up a men's and a grade school pair from here. And you know, we keep this thing moving, man. Keep it moving. These chili reds, man. They, I told you guys not to sleep on this shoe. Yes, the resale price has plummeted to 280 for bigger sizes, maybe 290 for size 13. Smaller sizes are 260, 250. Uh, but, you know, if you're able to know how to do like pre-orders and, you know, there's a method that I actually use with StockX that allows me to get a nice little profit from them. Uh, so this was a good, you know, a good cook, man. You know, make a few thousand bucks on a GR Jordan release is, you know, not bad. Uh, so head into the next, head into Champs right now, pick up this pair and then keep it moving. Keep it moving, man. Just thank God the sun is out, man. Chicago's weather is so trash, man. But, you know, we're going to pick this shoe up and then, you know, keep it moving. Let's go. So they got these here. This right here is going for some money. Right here. Got these. So let's see what size they got in these, man. To make some bread on here. These tight end ones don't look too bad as well. So I'm going to say, so right here, options. Man, these been sitting for a while, man. We got these. Got all these, man. So I might grab a few of these to keep it moving. So guys, man, got these. Uh, but good thing, man, you know, I'm gonna make a video about this, is that, you know, Foot Locker actually got a new contract with Adidas. And now you're gonna see more Foot Lockers and Champs get easy slides and, you know, easy phone runners, easy 350s and easy 700s. You will now see those at Foot Lockers and Champs. I'm gonna make a video about that, but they signed a big contract with each other because you know Nike kind of pulled back on Foot Locker and now Adidas came in just to basically you know have more of their products promoted. So you will see a lot more Yeezys at Foot Locker and Champs, but I will make a video about this. But you know, today's been a good day, man. We're, we're doing our thing out here, so let's get it. What's good, Snipe Game back in the car? We got a lot of shoes back there. We got shoes up here as well. Uh, so yeah, we about to go to a couple, I think like two more spots and call it a day. But overall, these nines were a pretty decent, man. There is going to be a lot of late shipments. We'll talk about that when we get back to the house. But overall, man, this was a good shoe to make some money on. Uh, the price is going to go down once people get pairs in hand from sneakers app. So the price is going to continue to go down. Right now it's 290 big, like size 13, size 11 is around 270-ish. So the price is going to keep on going down. So if you can sell them now, sell them. Again, there's going to be a lot of late shipments. Finish line, a lot of them didn't get their pairs in. So, you know, that, that's my advice for you on these, these nines. You know, I ended up selling these for a good amount, like 320 Some of them I did on StockX pre-order. I'm going to talk about that in a different video. But in my Discord, there's a way to get that top dollar price based on a pre-order from StockX and get your label scanned. Some of my Discord members have been using that. I personally use that because, again, it makes me more money. And, you know, we're going to just keep this thing moving, man. Pick up some more of these nines and we'll chat when we get back to the crib. Let's go. So, guys, back at the crib. And today was a good day, man. The Jordan 9 Chili Reds was a movie. I didn't hit on sneakers at, but as you guys can see behind there, I got a good amount of shoes, man. Like, there's always a science behind how I get these shoes for retail. And the Chili Reds, man, I was letting these go for like 320, 330 a pop on pre orders. And, guys, man, on Stock X earlier this week, they were going for like 390. 380 370 and a lot of people were able to get that price especially with this trick that i had a lot of discord members were able to do it uh with the stock x pre-order uh, again i'll make a separate video on that but guys there's a lot of things you can do with reselling man reselling man you can really make money with this if you know exactly what you're doing but let's take a look at these jordan 9 chili reds there is going to be a lot of late shipments again Finish line, JD Sports, they did not have men's pair online. Store, my finish line did not have men's pairs. They only had GS and the JD Sports, you know, only had like a few, like eight men's pairs 
and GS. So there will be a lot more late shipments. So guys, my recommendation, if you have these shoes right now, sell them. Sell them because the price will plummet when people get their pairs from the sneakers app and the price will plummet with all these late shipments coming because I believe some late shipments will come in next week. You just never know. But when they start coming in, that price is gonna plummet. So again, reselling, there's a lot of things behind reselling and a lot of things of how to maximize profits. That's what I'm an expert in, in maximizing profits and knowing when to sell. Again, I quick flip a lot, so I know how to do it, especially pre-orders. That is my secret sauce of how I'm able to do that. There's a lot of tools I utilize, but you know we'll talk about that at a separate time. But Discord members already know how I utilize that pre-order system, especially you know with StockX. But guys, let's take a look at one of these shoes right here. Now we have that Foot Locker bag right here. Let's take a look at these chili red Jordan 9s. It's funny because those 72 and 10 11s that are coming out the next week or this week, the, come, the week that's coming up, uh, they accidentally gave me the 72 and 10s instead of my chili reds. So I was going to walk out, but I actually did need these chili reds for pre-orders. So I took back the 72 and 10s and got the chili reds because I like, I need these actually now because I you know, actually sold them. But taking a look at this shoe, man this looks like more like a orange than an actual red but it's like a reddish orange kind of but these shoes right here man they're nice i'm not gonna even lie to you like i might even keep a pair for personal but these are definitely nice man the black bottom you have that patent glossy right here on the midsole black you got it. This is actually a nice shoe, man. What do you guys think about this shoe? Because I think this is definitely a dope shoe. Again, like I said, the price will plummet on this shoe. But overall, dope shoe. Dope shoe. You know, I was happy I was able to get some pairs on these nines. But I really do like them, man. I really do like this shoe. Again, it is a loud shoe. It's a very bright shoe. But because May is actually better than April. April was one of the worst months Jordan Brand has had in a while. And it was so dead. But now, you know, in May, we have the 72 and 10s. We have the Midnight Navies. We have the Jordan 4. So it's going to be a definitely a dope month. Oh, Snipe Gang, how did we do on these Jordan 9 Chili Reds? Did we take W's on the Flex app? I saw a lot of people on my live yesterday saying that they took W's. But there will be leftover pairs. I'm trying to see if there's going to be leftover day tomorrow. Tomorrow is Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers that watch my channel. And we'll see, man. I'm going for leftover pairs because I want to get as many as these as I can. And again, this shoe is going to plummet. Right now, it's 270, 280, 290. It is going to plummet once the sneakers at pairs come in and those late shipment pairs come in. So as I said earlier in the video, I recommend you sell it right now but, but i appreciate you guys man for watching this video man today was a good day man i hope everybody in snipe gang had a good day and was able to cook on these jordan nines it's funny because a lot of people have been hitting me up it's like hey sniper i sold these for 420 locally hey sniper i let these go for 320 a pop before they came out so a lot of people made money on this shoe i told you guys not to sleep on this shoe and i was correct i'm not sleeping on this shoe because again supply and demand when there's late shipments and a shoe looks good the, the prices is going to be higher than it normally would be so guys that's what i'm telling you guys you got to know what is going on and i saw a lot of people make money on this shoe but overall a decent shoe like i said appreciate you guys for watching the video we're going to keep coming with fire videos adidas man adidas has a new contract with foot locker so you will get yeezy slides you will get yeezy phone runners you will get all those yeezy shoes now with the foot locker flex app so it's going to be interesting man i'm going to make a video on that tomorrow so stay tuned make sure you subscribe to the channel smash that like button of course hit that notification bell because i will keep you guys updated with everything sneaker related teach you guys how to make money teach you guys how to cop for retail all that stuff i will teach you guys how to do so make sure you subscribe to the channel really do appreciate you guys you already know sniper kicks out peace